Roads are wet, but traffic flowing again on 526 this morning. All lanes are back open after a semi hit a messenger board on the highway. News 2's Ashley. All five all morning and joins us right now. Good morning, Octavia. Yes, as you can see, the lanes are all open now. South Carolina Department of Transportation just left. They put a temporary message board sign here in the median. They said we've got to have a message board sign here, and that permanent one went down this morning. It's clear now, but earlier today when we got here around 4 a.m., that was not the case. Take a look at what happened when this 18-wheeler hit the message board sign that hangs out over the interstate. It hit at about 1.30 this morning, and we got here at about four. They were working on getting that 18 wheeler out of the interstate, and then they moved on to the digital message board sign to pull it down and out of the way. But this wasn't an easy feat because those things have a lot of wires attached to them. They weigh around 6,000 pounds, so it took a while for them to get it out of the way safely. They, their mission this morning was to just get it out of the way so traffic could remain coming through this area on 526 westbound. They say a crew will come back at a later date to put it back up again. And we talked to South Carolina Department of Transportation and asked why did he hit this sign? They weren't sure. All they know is was that he jackknifed. They say a similar situation happened on Highway 61 not too long ago. They just got that sign back up and running. And so we're not sure right now exactly what happened to cause him to run into that sign, but we are working on that. We will get those details to you as soon as we get them on our website, countonto.com. Live right now on I-25-26 Westbound, I'm Ashley Yost, News 2.